Now let us bow thy servant depart in peace, for mine eyes have seen thy salvation. Which you have prepared in the sight of all people, a light for revelation to the Gentiles, and for glory to your people, Israel. Amen. The evening on the Monday, the 18th. No, I am not at peace with. Having to do whatever it is I do in whichever place I happen to find myself at the time. It's the best I can do. I'm not a, a monster or something, whatever. I'm in the world, I'm just in the world meeting people, getting on with my life in whatever way I find each day. to say to people who ask me, you know, Christ, I were Christians, but you know, what about the Muslims? They believe in that as well. well I mean, there's this question of religious intolerance. Exclusive. I am a jealous God. Thou shalt have no other gods but me. You brought the Muslims into the world through Ishmael, yes, so that is your will. My duty is to love you to love my neighbor as myself, but to love you exclusively, that is your wish. Yes, I must love my neighbor, be he of whatever faith, other than Christian, or no faith, indeed, but not their faith. I cut these people because if they can't see that, if one can't see that, then I'm afraid you just have to go away and think about it on your own, really. Work it out yourself. I mean, I'll be very clear. And our current Archbishop, poor old Dr. Rowan Williams, thinks Sharia law is a good idea in England, so he's sort of what is he, leaning towards Muslims, trying to accommodate them or something? As human beings, yes, but not their faith. One doesn't want to be offensive, obviously, to people, and especially over matters of faith, because it causes such trouble, has done throughout the centuries, yes, we know that. circumstances, but I just despair, quite frankly. What to say to someone who, who can't see that? I, what I said, which is that they don't have faith. If, if you love God through Christ, you love God through Christ. You, you don't, you know that you love God through Christ. You don't have, you know, you don't worry about anyone else's faith. That's their affair. Let them get on with it. I love you, my Lord, with all my heart, soul, mind, and strength. 